So I was looking at Hudson Sawmills online and they had a locate a dealer button so I clicked that and it was like the whole United States so I started zooming in and I realized that there was a Hudson Sawmill dealer in Wisconsin and that it looked like it was pretty close. I thought it was closer than it was. It turns out it's like an hour and a half away. And so I called them and they, they said they're sold out. They have none left. I'm like, I'm like, well, what would it cost just to, would you sell one without the tracks? Because I don't need the tracks. He's like, well, if you don't need the tracks, actually I have a display model you can buy. And I'm like, well, how much would that cost? And we went over that. And so I decided that I would come buy it because he could sell it without the tracks and I, that's what I need. And so it's just kind of amazing that this all happened. Okay, we've arrived at the GPS address and it's a grocery store. So either the grocery store sells sawmill or we're at the wrong location. So go check it out. <laughs> Let's call him. Let's call and find out. All right. But I bought a sawmill. Saw from a grocery store. <laughs> Cause it turns out the dealer was actually just kind of like a side business that this grocery store owner does just to try and make more money. But he's making more money cause I just bought a bandsaw from him. A grocery store. In the freezer section. In the freezer section. It was sitting on top of the frozen food. The freezers. The freezers. It was sitting on top of the freezers on a pallet. They had to bring a forklift in to get it down and put it on my trailer. This is awesome. You can't get better than this. 